Research complete. Hello friends, my name is Pradeek Kumar. Let's start at tutorial number two about the Lavi plus Python. Okay, this is about the string function. How we can add multiple strings. Okay, now first very important part. And uh, if someone is new, then visit the first tutorial that is this one, a uh, Lavi plus Python tutorial number one. Add two numbers because in this video I already tell about which software you need step by step and smart saving the files because help of that we can easy to learn step by step. Okay. The first visit this one now let's come on the second one that is tutorial number two okay now first you need to save uh, you need to create a one file that is live view python vi this one okay and save the uh, location and uh, let i will show you uh this tutorial number one i already uh, uploaded the video next is uh, let's come on the tutorial number two string function okay open this and this file i'll save in this folder okay and i'm creating new folder that is python code and path okay uh, we will create a python file in this folder okay here now what you do let's open the uh, python software and search here python ide this one okay and click to open okay now go to file and click to file new file let's i delete uh cross this one yes now we need to uh, create a code here uh, let's start i'm in here uh output string this one is our global variable okay and i'm as a sign that is our string data type next now we need to create a function that is def i'm in here any name that is a uh, same uh, lab view or we can say a uh, lab view string this one this one is your function name okay and in the bracket we need to uh, need to pass the parameters that is very important and i'm in here a uh, name one a uh, name one comma name two yes and now what we do uh, what we need we need to add two numbers then how we can do this enter output okay this one output string equal to you need to add name one like name one comma uh sorry plus name two this one yes now let's i'm in here return we need to return the output that is output string output string this one okay everything is done now let's run in python oh, what's the result okay okay i'm creating one variable that is a uh, uh, a equal okay, to now we need to call the function that is a uh, lab view string and we need to enter the parameter okay manually uh first i'm enter here like for deep okay uh comma next one is lab view this one okay this one is parameter for testing the this code okay and uh, right now i'm using the print and we need to enter a okay because this uh, parameter store in our a and a is display because we use the return type okay uh, first we call to live string go to here and this pradeep store in name one live view store in name two and name one and two uh, add and uh, save in output string uh, next, uh, next one is written and it's uh, give the output and help of this we can easy to see yes now what you do first let's um, give the space run and click to run module okay and uh, sorry we need to save the file first and uh, let me uh, give the our location d and i already created a folder okay love you uh how youtube next one is python file uh sorry uh python youtube and second one this one and this one python code and path okay now let's um, save here that is a uh, uh, string or we can say python string 2 now click to save yes and see the output for the plan view okay everything is done now cross and let's i delete this one not need to use this one yes and file save this okay and cross this one 
now what we do we need to create a project in uh, or we can say we need to create a vi for give the uh, python a uh, part uh, now what you do let's open the lab view and go to new file new vi okay uh, press ctrl t uh, yes right click here and uh, go to file io pin this one uh, use a uh, string path and build path next one is file constant i'm using current vi path okay uh, you can use directly vi path no uh, need to uh, create a separate vi but it's a very important to uh, create a new vi for help of this you can easy to learn step by step uh, about these icons we already told in video one okay then follow a video tutorial number one next uh, connect to this one okay this one is our current vi next is strip path uh, connect to base path and you need to give the your python uh, file path here now that is python string to create constant and enter here uh, python string to this one okay and give the extension dot py uh, yes everything is done and here the output right click and create indicator this one this is another one is output yes now let's increase this uh, path okay and first uh, save your project or we can save your vi and uh, this vi we store in this python code and path save here i am and here uh, lab view lab view python uh, sorry python path and click to ok yes now click to run and see the output D yes and let's increase and see this one is our vi okay this one is perfectly path okay now let's modify and create the icon double click this one and go to layer delete this create a box go to text m and here python path 3.6 click to ok yes now we need to use the output ok this one click to this and press control select this one ok this one is output assign here uh, now save ok and you see our vi is created here okay everything is in now let's come to the our main vi this one yes now uh, what you do right click here and uh, go to connectivity python pin this one uh, drag open python not this one next please close python session okay cross and right now this session out connect to session in session out to session in this one and this one is python version right click create a uh, like control this one okay and i'm and here uh, the version that is 3.6 let's increase yes next one is this module path right click here and select a vi sorry select a vi and this one we already created here live python path okay drag here and this one is output you need to connect to this one yes when you click to double click to this one and you see uh, click to run and this one is our path we already created here now okay now close and next step is function name right click and create a control this one is function name you need to enter function name okay and our function name is uh, i think lab view string okay uh, now let's verify open a uh, python code and python file and uh, open this one and see uh, this one is our function lab view string okay let's i'm copy cross minimize and i'm paste here uh, we need to enter manually a lab view string okay now let's increase next is our uh, written type 
okay now uh, our written type is string string data type now what we need right click here and go to string you need to use this constant okay and connect to this terminal written type okay now drag and uh, uh, I have two inputs then you need to use here okay right click here and go to silver this one uh, have string and use string control okay I meant here uh, name one okay or we can say enter name one let's increase okay and copy name two yes let's modify and you need to connect to first terminal name one second is connect to second terminal like this like this and this one is our written value create indicator this one is our output yes now let's I'm enter anything and for increase the size yes let's delete okay Same. everything is fine now this one is a route and you need to connect error in this one is our output and uh, you need to click to run okay it's working let's I'm enter name that is uh, first for the give the space okay second is our lab view this one and click to run and see the output Pradeep Lavio. okay help of Python now let's um, change uh, the name that is uh, hello guys this one and click to run and see the output hello guys and you see it's combined you need to give the space like this and click to run and see hello guys. Uh, like if I am enter a uh, star like this space and click to run and you see hello star guys okay you can easy to do as per your comment okay and thank you so much if you like this video please like and subscribe our channel thank you so much guys